Oh, she is gorgeous. You guys, oh my gosh. So that's how it looks. I got the silver one I told you. Bitch. Hey you guys, welcome back or welcome to another video girl. So right now I'm in the car as you can see and as you can hear my turning signal. Um I said I wanna I might as well introduce the vlog while I'm waiting on my red light. But right now I'm trying to get into Starbucks. The line is kind of long over there, so I'm like, do I want to go to this one or the one in Target Plaza? But I don't feel like going to Target because I'm gonna spend more money. So I think I'm gonna just go to this one. But um I look a mess. I wanted to show you guys. I went to my one of my best friends um pajama party last night and y'all I was so cute. So you see the little <laughs> thing on my head. But um surprisingly I woke up at eight o'clock this morning. I was supposed to go and get my nails done. I mean not my nails, my lashes done. Y'all, it's the same lash tech and she she texted me yesterday and said, Are you still coming tomorrow? Just confirm and I said, Yes, I am coming. I text her this morning to like verify her address and she texted me back and said, um, sorry, we're going to have to cancel because I'm waiting on my COVID test. I had a, a, she had a client that tested positive. Like I'm telling y'all the universe don't want to see me get my lashes done. Like, I don't know. Sorry y'all for the light. I had needed to do a U-turn, but I'm going to just turn right here. But yeah, so <clears throat> that's why I was up early um, and just, I don't know. I really can't sleep that late no more, but oh my God, look at him. Oh, Jesus. That's so sad. They need to come and get him. Y'all, it's this black boy, young boy dancing on the highway like obviously he on something oh that's sad oh jesus and then now he want to cross the road lord please but i'm going to starbucks first oh! sorry i'm going to starbucks first before um i do anything else because so i've been thinking about starbucks y'all i look a mess y'all i wash my face my face might look a little dry because i washed my face and I didn't put on no moisturizer because it's kind of hot over here where I'm at. Yeah, the line long, but I'm gonna still stick in the line. Yeah, oh, let me stitch y'all up because I might be sitting here for a minute. <laughs> Not really. Starbucks lines be moving fast. Y'all see it still? It's already moving. But, um, yeah. So, like I said, was I ordered my phone, I think it was Thursday. And um, when I ordered my phone, they said that it was on back order, <clears throat> that it wasn't gonna be here until the 29th. Sorry, y'all. <clears throat> and so I was expecting for the 29th, but I had checked my, cause it texted me and said it had shipped like literally the next day. No, it, it I must've did it Wednesday. I think I did it Wednesday. But I checked it the next day and then it was like, it was already shipped that it would be here Saturday. So I'm like, nah, they just bullshitting. Y'all, my package is out for delivery today, like right now. So I need to go and get me a case and then it'll get me a screen protector because I will not drop that fucking phone. I will not drop that phone, okay? So after I leave him going to Best Buy, which is right in the next plaza, and then I still gotta get some house stuff. I gotta get some tissue. It's like I'm always gotten to get some tissue, y'all. Last time I went and got tissue, I bought two things of uh paper towels. I didn't even get tissue, so I gotta get tissue. I wanna get me some stuff to make me some breakfast and well the finishing stuff because I got some stuff at the house. I need to get some bread because I wanna make some French toast. I think I might get me some more syrup and I might just get me some more eggs because yeah, I need more eggs anyways. I just want to check in and say, hey girl, hey, this is the start of the new vlog. I think this is gonna be a weekly vlog. Well, not a whole week because Christmas is coming and I wanna do that, I wanna do that a separate vlog. But um, yeah, so. I had to fix my hair a little bit. 
I think I get my hair done. When is when is the twenty second? Wednesday. Yeah. So I get my hair done Wednesday. I need to go. I need to go Christmas shopping because I haven't done that yet, y'all. I only shop for one person, but I already know what I'm gonna get everybody. I gotta shop for four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten people. I should have been did it, but it's okay. I still got, I got some time. And y'all, I was so cute for my pajama party yesterday. I had on like this lingerie leotard up under this um, pajama set pants with the long sleeve shirt that buttoned up. And I had it open. So the lingerie was showing up. Listen y'all, it was so freaking cute. And I had fun, like. This camera got me, even though I don't got nothing like is dry, but my skin looks looks good though. See, I get oily right here, right here. So, this is the tip to know if you have dry skin, oily skin, or combination skin. So, what you do is you wash your face with which, whichever. Um, face cleanser that you use you wash your face and then you don't put no moisturizer don't put nothing on it and let it sit for 30 minutes and if you have dry patches and if it's like if your skin is dry then you know you got dry skin if it's oily even without putting any product on it you got oily skin and if it's it's combination if from my face for example I get oily like in my t-zone areas but my cheeks and stuff be dry dry so I have combination skin. Tip of the day, girl. Tip of the day. I wonder if they let me drink, bring my coffee in though. So I just left Target. Um, I had to go to Target anyways because, well, I didn't have to go to Target. But I ended up going to Target because Best Buy didn't have nothing. They didn't have no cases. It didn't have nothing. And it's crazy because, oh, it's lying. And it's crazy because before I got this phone, I seen all types of cases for the iPhone 12, 13 Pro Max. Like, and I'm like, damn, like they don't even make cases for the um, 11 Pro Max no more. Like I never see new cases or nothing like that. In general, never see them. But Best Buy had nothing. So I said, let me just go to Target because I remember Target having a lot of cases. Y'all, I get to Target, they don't got no cases. Like, what? But when I, when I tell y'all Target was so freaking packed, like, packed. Like, packed. When I say packed, I mean packed. So, no, y'all know me. When I go to Target, I shop. But I had to get the hell up out of there. Like, no. So I, all I got from now, I had to get tissue. I got tissue and then I end up getting a case and I'll show y'all that case. But I, and then I was scared because um, I'm waiting on UPS to come. And I called my cousin cause my cousin live about, she lived this way, closest to this way. So I call her and I'm just like, what time does UPS normally come? Because whenever I get stuff delivered to my grandma house, they UPS always come like around five, so I'll know like you know they not gonna come early in the morning over here. I've, I haven't had anything delivered over here, so I call her. She's like, yeah, they be delivering around noon, noon one o'clock, y'all, and it's twelve fifty. But as I was pulling into Target, I seen a UPS truck. I'm just like, fuck, cause Target right down the road from my house. I'm like, I need to get home. So I was rushing in there anyways. But like, I, I was like, I wanted to get eggs and stuff like that. I didn't know. I'm not, I don't have time to play with these old folks in the stores. Like, I just get irritated. I like to go to the stores when it's nobody there. Y'all, so I'm low key feeling some type of way, just a little bit. So I literally just put up to the house like three minutes ago, right? And so, <clears throat> I was rushing to get back. I told you guys because I was trying to make it for my package. Anyways, I got, I just, as soon as I pulled up, I sat in the car for like two minutes. And then I seen the UPS walker walk in to, you know, drop off my package. So, I made it just in time. 
But the thing that bothers me is he literally, because he didn't know I was sitting in the car, he literally just sat it on my porch. He didn't knock. He didn't wait for somebody to come and sign for it because the thing said you need a signature. He sat it on my porch. I'm finna walk the fuck away. Like, the fuck? So I got out. I'm just like, thank you. Like, you don't need a signature. And he was just like, oh, apparently I do. Apparently I just need your last name. Like, so what you was gonna sign it for me? I don't understand. And just leave it on my porch. But the good news is I, I made it literally just in time. Like, literally just in time. As soon as I pulled up, two, three minutes later, he's pulling up. But he wasn't even in a UPS truck, y'all. He was in his regular van. I don't know much about UPS, but he was in his regular, he was in his van, like his own personal van. He had on dirty ass clothes. Sorry, not saying nothing about that because you don't know what nobody's situation is. But he had on a regular t shirt with some gym shorts. And he just had the vest on over his clothes. And I'm like, what kind of janky ass shit is this? I'm used to UPS with they sexy ass uniforms on, getting out their UPS truck. Like, that's what I'm used to. I'm not used to them being in the regular van. But anyways, yeah. So, I do. I got my, I got my phone. I got my package. So, we're going to unbox this together, y'all. We're going to unbox it together. Hey you guys, so I'm back at the house. As you can tell, I've been here for a while. As soon as I got home, I just immediately took me a nap, a very small, tiny nap. <laughs> but yeah, so um, we finna open up this iPhone. I'm gonna open it up with you guys. And I'm talking about open it up from the beginning, like the whole box. So yes, so let's get to unboxing girl. <laughs> So when you open the box, you got the information from Verizon. It tells you how it tells you how to get started. Can y'all see that? It got instructions on how to get started. And then this paper here. Hold on, y'all. Yeah. And then this paper here is just my name total of the phone i thought the phone was more pricier than this but but anywho verizon so this is the phone you guys oh my god yeah i am so excited so this is the box the box looks way different from the normal ones that it comes in um and if you don't know i am upgrading from the 11 pro mat so i didn't get the 12 and because i was waiting on the 13 i'm just like i don't know so yeah oh so i guess you gotta pull that to take it off with these little tabs oh yeah, and that's how you open it Oh, she is gorgeous. You guys. Oh my gosh. So that's how it looks. I got this silver one. I told you. Bitch. Oh my God. Bro. <laughs> oh my God. Anyways. Stupid of me. But I got this silver one. As you can see. Y'all. I hope this showing up pretty good. I got this silver one. Y'all, it's so nice. Hey, look at this. Look. Oh, this is beautiful. Like, look at that. Oh, my gosh. Y'all, this is nice. I've always wanted the silver one. And look how big the cameras is. I've always wanted um, a silver phone. And it's like silver, but it looks white. But I love the chrome sides. Like, I just love this. And look how big the cameras are. So, I want to just do, like, a quick comparison from my old phone. So, I told you guys I have the 11 Pro Mats. Look at how the, the difference is between... This is the comparison of the 11 Pro Mats and the 13. Look how big the cameras is. Like, look at that. 
and it's even thicker so you can see like it's thicker that's the 13 and that's the 11. wow and it's heavier it's way heavier oh now let's pull it off oh she is gorgeous oh my god y'all she is gorgeous look at that y'all oh my god i'm in love let's turn her on y'all it's just so beautiful i've always had the uh gold phone always um i went i had space gray once i think when it was the the eight plus i had the space gray which was basically like the black one but i've always had the rose gold so this is new y'all oh my god even the colors and stuff looks so let's see let's swipe up english But like, I don't know if I want to set it up because I don't want all my, I don't want everything off this phone onto here. Like I don't want all my pictures and stuff like onto here. So let me see if I can. Okay, so we finna set it up. We finna put the Wi-Fi in. So now it wants me to set up the face ID. So. Look at me. you okay and you can show my password I don't want to transfer apps and data. I don't. It said an uh, Apple device. It said on my phone that an Apple device near me or Apple device is trying to log into um, my iCloud near Miami, Florida. I'm not near Miami, Florida, but okay. So agree. I don't want to transfer any data. When I set up the phone, I'll be back because I'm not sure what I'm doing. So I'm not going to do all that on camera because it's a learning progress for me. But when I get back, I'm going to show y'all how it look with my case on. And once I'm done, once I figure out exactly what I'm going to do with the phone. But y'all, the phone is beautiful. Like, it's beautiful. But yeah, I'll be back. So you guys, I just finished setting up the phone. But, um... I didn't I didn't transfer anything over from my old phone because I didn't want to like I want a fresh start on this phone like I do a fresh start and whatever I need like if eventually if I want to share my like send stuff over then I will but right now for the time no um but yes this is the phone like even the colors and stuff look so good like okay so let's put the case on so I did get all I just got um the apple i um the apple pink apple silicone case the brand the apple brand and let's take it out jesus i like it didn't want to come out so i just got the pink one and This is a beautiful phone, you guys. Oh my God, I love it. So this is the case. This is how the case looks on it. If you don't know, pink is by far my favorite color. But yeah, y'all, I'm in love. I'm in love, I am. Like the difference of the phone, like it just, I don't know. I'm loving the squareness of it. 
I definitely got to get a screen protector. But even like the feel of it, it just feels different. Like a much bigger phone. Like I'm, I love it. But yes, you guys, once I finish setting it up and doing everything, then I'll show y'all if y'all are interested. I don't know, but I'll be back. So this is the phone, y'all. Oh my gosh. I love it. I do. If you have the 11 Pro Max right now, this is an upgrade. Definitely is. I didn't show you guys what all come in the box, but when you open a box, um, this is what comes with it. This the same thing that comes with all the Apple devices with the... I guess this is what you use to do the SIM card. This, this is the Apple sticker. And then it comes with just the charger. It does not come with the block. Thank God I do have a block, but I think this is so crazy because what if people are just switching on to iPhone? They don't have this from the last phone. Or even if they're coming from the X, S Mats, I think that's the one that, yeah, I believe that's the one that does not have this type of charger. You gotta go and buy the block. And that shit is not cheap. Yeah, so I'm on the phone right now with, um, well, not on the phone with them. As you can hear the music, um, I'm calling Verizon so they can help me with my activation. Jesus, you is loud. To help me activate my service. Um, Penelope is using the bathroom. Yeah. So I didn't even, I know I said earlier that I was going to get me some stuff for breakfast. I didn't even go and get it. So I think my boyfriend is going to bring us back something to eat um, in a little bit. And I'm probably going to eat some chip and dip until then. I'm probably going to be on hold forever. Y'all, it's nice outside. I don't know. I got like a whole bag full of stuffed animals like this because my boyfriend used to always eat Den Denny's when we had one closer to us. He still do. But he will always win this for me every time he will go to Denny's and they little, you know, the little machine game or whatever. But he say he wanted to get us to Penelope. The last one we gave her, she destroyed it. She put out all the stuffing on the inside. Like she just really destroyed it. So he, I don't know. He's, I think she's going to be scared of it, but ain't this cute though. <laughs> I'm going to give it to her now. Look, girl. The last one we got her, she played with it. She, oh, she playing with it. But she bit it up, took all the stuff out, which I'm pretty sure that's what she gonna do to this one. Yep, yep, that's exactly what she finna do. And she like it. So you guys, a quick update. Um, I am currently on hold. They answered the phone 55 minutes later. And I've been on hold for, I've been on the phone for an hour and 18 minutes, as you can see. So, I cannot activate my phone. My phone will not activate, like with me doing it, it won't do it. I tried every way possible. So, I called them, and he's trying to figure out why. Like, they, every, when I gave him my number, or even when I tried to do it online with my number, they said that the account is not active. So how the fuck do I activate it? But I end up calling customer service. And like I said, I was on hold for 55 minutes. When he finally answered, he's been trying to like find my service, blah, blah, blah. I gave him my number. So he's like, yeah, we, we found it. But um, it says that the um, activation will not be until the 20th. Today is the 18th. Why do I have to wait till the 20th if I already have my phone? So they got me on hold again. That beeping that you hear that's coming from them having me on hold. But I have to, um, he's trying to see if they can activate it earlier than the 20th since I have, I'm like, Jesus. So just a little update. I'm irritated as fuck because be for real. But anyways, um, just a little update. 
Yeah. So they came to the conclusion that they cannot activate it no earlier than the 20th. So I have to wait until the 20th for the phone to be activated. Thank God I still have my other phone that is on because I would have been pissed, okay? This phone would have been going back first trip in the morning. Hey, you guys. So, um, my boyfriend just called me and randomly asked that I want to go to the outlets. I think he's trying to get him something to wear because he think he's going out tonight. I don't know about that, but... <laughs> Um, I'm waiting for him to come and pick me up, but I am dressed. Y'all already done seen this leotard. I got on this jacket, and then I got on some army fatigue shorts that I can probably show y'all once I get downstairs. But, yep, that's what's going on. Um, I don't plan on getting anything unless I see something um, for Christmas shopping, but, yeah. Just wanted to check in, y'all. I'm so upset about my phone because I want my phone. I want my phone. Well, let me see if I can go and get like a view of how I look right now. I have on the same black leotard. I have on my jean jacket. Y'all done seen this jean jacket before. And I just have on these shorts that I've had for a while now. And I think I got these from Ross a while ago. But I'm a, oh Jesus, I done dropped my perfume, child. Ugh. But yeah, I'm gonna spray some perfume. So, the perfume of the night is Versace Bright Crystal, if y'all can see that. Y'all, it smells so good. I'm pretty sure everybody has smelled this before. But yeah, it just smells so fresh. It do. I have to smell everything. Like, I don't know, I already know what it smells like. <laughs> y'all, so I end up changing my shorts. I just end up putting on these black shorts. I think the all black look better. Because I'm going to put on my black uh, sandals my black slides with the glitter on it and yeah I think this looks better to me it does the all black y'all whenever I'm getting ready to go somewhere I can never just pick out an outfit and that be my outfit no I'm gonna change at least two times okay at least two times and if I pick out an outfit and wear that then girl I'm good then I'm real good <laughs> yeah I still have these popsicles that we had from my Christmas party I don't know why. I think I was the only one that was eating them. So I'm finna try one. Um, guess I can do the. Oh. Is there any more strawberry daiquiris? That's the one I really want. Strawberry daiquiris. Yep. And I don't know. And it's hot. They don't they don't freeze like that. I guess because it's liquor. But it takes a long time for them to freeze. I don't think I showed y'all these when I had them for the party. But these are the ones that I got. Largo Bay. And I'm eating the strawberry daiquiri one. But they have like different type of flavors in it. But yeah. Y'all this is so good. I have became a loner for real because not even a loner but I mean but yeah I'm not gonna say a loner and I wouldn't even say an introvert because I'm not an introvert I don't know I guess it's like half and half but I am a people person like when I'm out and about like I am a people person I can talk to you carry a conversation with you, have fun with you. Like, I can do all that. But it's like, lately, I just, I don't know. I think it's because I'm kind of stepping into my grown woman, I guess. I don't know. Because a lot has, my mind has changed a lot. So, certain stuff that I was, like, interested in, like, a half a year ago, or a year, I'm going to just say a year ago, it's like, I'm not interested in that stuff no more. Like, the crowd that I was hanging with before like I'm not into those type of people anymore like it's nothing against them I'm just what they do don't excite me and I guess I just had to grow up I guess I don't know like going to clubs and going to block parties and stuff like that don't excite me no more like 
I'm, don't get me wrong not wrong I love outside but it's just like not as exciting as it was before whenever it was a whenever it was an event going on I'm making my business to go find me an outfit find me something cute to wear a brand new outfit I don't care if I wore an outfit before wore it one time is if I took a picture in something I'm not wearing it again not to no event I'll wear it on like a day-to-day -day type of thing, but I'm not gonna wear it again to, a, to an event. Because w once I take a picture in it, that's it. <laughs> I was gonna give me a new outfit every time, new outfit, new shoes, literally. A new outfit, new shoes, new hairdo for an event that lasts for two to three hours, and then that's it, and I'll never wear that stuff again. Like, girl. What was you really doing out here in these streets? <laughs> but no, I think it's just me maturing a little bit more. Not saying people who who still does that are not mature. That's not what I'm saying at all. What I'm saying is I think I'm just maturing and finding out who what's for me, what's best for me. You know what I'm saying? And I'm just kind of transitioning into that phase. I just honestly think that like... My mindset has been very different. I still have a lot of work to do um, to get exactly to that point where I want to be. But I feel like, yeah. And y'all, I was watching somebody, I was watching somebody video today, their blog. And I honestly, when I first started watching her videos, like a couple of days ago, I found her. And her vibe and everything just seemed so cool. Like I immediately subscribed to her. But I watched a video today that really rubbed me the wrong way. So, she's like all this type like, how she never came from the struggle, she don't know the struggle, this, that, and the third. Okay, we get that. Yes, that's not everybody's story. We get that. But to be boastful about it and just throwing it out there like, oh, I ain't never had to struggle. I ain't never got to worry about that. What about the people who did have to struggle? Like, people who are supporting you that is in the struggle right now or did have to struggle. Like, how you think that that would make them feel? How do you expect for your followers and your supporters to feel? You can you can say it in a different way. Like, of course, you, you can embrace the fact that you had people that took care of you that made sure you were straight at all times, but you don't have to throw that out there, oh, I never had to struggle. I don't know what the struggle is. Like, I just think that that's kind of crazy. And if I'm wrong, y'all, tell me I'm wrong, because I'm that type of person. If I'm wrong, I like for people to like be like, you know, call me out of my shit. But for I think that's crazy. Like, what about the people who did have to struggle? Or, like I said, that they're struggling now. And they supposed to, like look up to you or you're supposed to be an influencer but yeah that's the type of shit you say mm -hmm. i just that just ain't me i never really had to struggle in life so it didn't affect me no way like it wasn't a kick in my face because i never really had to, but i know what the struggle is honey i do I know exactly what the I know exactly what it looked like. I do, but I'm not. The, I'm not saying I'm the type that, you know, went through that a, a real deal struggle. There's people out there have it worse than me, but I would never get online and be like, mm mm. I've always been luxury. I've always been living a luxury. Like, okay. I just think like I'm not that type of person. I'm not type. Even if I'm living this grand life. Like, I got a nice-ass townhome, but I don't boast that up in people's face. Like, oh, you live in an apartment, girl. I got a townhouse. I got a two-bedroom. You got a one-bedroom. Or you got a studio, and I got a two. Like, I don't do that because I'm telling you, okay? You have, you have to be humble, okay? You have to be humble because God will take everything that you have right from you and show you and, and bring you right on back down. And show you that it can be taken away from you. Don't be like, be grateful for what you got. I don't know. But that just rubbed me the wrong way. Because like, I never want to be around nobody like that. They're always throwing up what they got. 
or bragging or saying, you know what I'm saying, belittling people that is that's less fortunate than them. Because I would never do no shit like that, ever. I give respect to the housekeeper and the janitor at the same fucking respect that I give the administrator or the DON or the uh, all that shit. I don't give a damn. The same respect as the presidents I would give to a fucking janitor or a housekeeper or a homeless person. I don't give a I don't give a damn. I'm not that type of person. I'm not. And people who do shit like that, I just I look at them like different. Like, but I just had to say that because y'all yeah, please don't be like that. Yes, be very grateful for the stuff you have, especially if you've never had it. So if you coming from being homeless to having this house that you built, then yes, brag about it. But don't be little people in the process of doing that. Don't do that. Just don't do that. Y'all, this damn deck be good. But I'll talk to y'all later. Because, yeah. Hey, you guys. Good morning. Um, today is Sunday. <laughs> Yesterday, I didn't come back on here. I thought I told you that we were going to the outlets. It was crazy. Um, we got there kind of late. And... The whole time, like I couldn't even vlog or show anything because the whole time we was like on the go, on the go, on the go, going to the store from store trying to find stuff for um, my boyfriend, and then I end up getting something from Armani Exchange. Um, I just got me like a sweatsuit short set um, that I'm probably gonna wear on Christmas, and that's it. And we wasn't even really there long, y'all. Afterwards, we lost the car. Could not figure out where the car was at for nothing. We was looking at for the car for about probably 45 minutes. Yeah, it was crazy. It was a disaster. So it was nothing to really show. And then once we got home, um, we went and got food. And we ate food. And then I went to sleep after that. So, but yeah. Um, today is Sunday. I was not even going to say it. But <laughs> today is Sunday. And <clears throat> you can hear my clothes in the washing machine. I'm waiting for it to get done so I can get dressed. And I'm heading out to do a little bit of Christmas shopping. I want to get my nails done, but I don't think I'm going to do it. I said I'm going to not buy nothing for myself. Try not to for myself until the holidays is over because I need to really get everybody Christmas gifts. So that's my plan for today. And I just want to check in and say good morning, y'all. My battery is dying. That's nothing new. Y'all see I done put my hair down and I cut me some little bangs. This side I cut a little bit too short, but it looks okay. I just cannot wait to get my hair done. Like, I cannot wait. <laughs> yeah, so I changed my mind about the outfit I'm wearing. Um, I just have on this Nike, you see the mark? I mean the, I just have on this Nike jumpsuit. Um, this is how it looks. I got it off the shoulder a little bit because I just hate how the jacket feel. I mean, fit. So I got it off the shoulder. And this is how, I got a Nike on the side. I have never really wore this. Um, I stained it so and for some reason it would not get clean yeah this is this is the outfit of the day girl y'all so <laughs> I got a dress and everything to go out so I can do my little Christmas shopping and y'all I done turned around and I'm back at the house like I done got sleepy at the I went to Wawa and I got me something like a snack or something to eat really quick and then now i'm like back tired so y'all wouldn't believe i'm back at the house and finna take me a nap yeah very much so i done got tired i probably finna take like an hour nap and then i'm gonna get up and like get my ass out because i need to i need to do some grocery i mean not grocery shop i need to do that too but i need to do christmas shopping Y'all see, I'm tired. Like, I'm already rubbing my eyes. And so, yeah. <laughs> I just think it's funny because I got all dressed up. Well, not all dressed up, but I put on clothes and everything in the car on my way to prepare to go shopping. And then, yeah. <laughs> so, I just I just think that's very fucking funny. But, yeah. So, that's what I'm finna go in the house, y'all. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. I woke up really early. I'm finna go and take me a nap. So, yeah. <laughs> hey y'all so we is back up for round two we're gonna try it again it's about 2 30 right now i took me like a hour and a half now and so i'm gonna get out and i'm gonna do some shopping i changed from out of that jump sweatsuit that i had on because 
when I got out there, it was kind of warm out there. And I'm just like, yeah, even though it's comfortable, I know I'm going to be hot. So I just got on this dress. Nothing special, just a dress. Yeah, so I'm going to try to handle some business so I can hurry up and get back home. It's because I got stuff to do here at the house, too. And I got to also do some stuff for work. Yeah, you could tell I just woke up. My face be puffy when I first wake up. But yeah, so that's what's going on. Um, today, well, next week is like our Christmas week at work to where we have to, well, we don't have to, but we have um, this calendar where I think tomorrow we're going to like dress in red and green, like overdo it with the accessories, with the clothes. Tuesday, I think it's like care today. Wednesday is ugly sweater day. Thursday is twin day. And then Friday is pajama day. So I want to see if I can find me something for tomorrow. Um, and then I'm going to do a little bit of Christmas shopping to go ahead and get out of the way. Because my work week, I be getting late work. <laughs> I be getting out of work late. And I know that I probably won't have time to do it throughout the week. So I might as well utilize this day and do what I got to do. Be productive. So, yep, I just want to check in and let y'all know that I'm finally up. And we finna try it again, girl. <laughs> hey, y'all. So, we is back at the house. I did a lot of shopping today, y'all. It is 10... 10 36 and i think i left this house about almost three o'clock today so i've been gone since then um i was out with my mom and my brother and we did sorry y'all was looking at penelope but we did a lot of shopping and i still have to go back tomorrow if i have time or sometime throughout this week and finish for a couple people i think i got like three I think I like three or four more people tomorrow that I gotta finish up on. But oh yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I got like three or four people I need to finish up on, and that's it. So this is the gifts. I'm gonna start wrapping tonight, I think. But these are some of the gifts. I don't want to show. I don't want to show what I got because. People who I got stuff for, they watch my videos and then they're going to see what I got them. So, yeah, but we finna wrap some gifts tonight. Um, I'm tired. Like, I don't know. I'm not tired. It's just when you walk all day and shop all day, like, that's an exercise, honey. So, yeah, but we back at the house. I think I'm finna make me um, a mixed drink so I can, like, calm down and relax yeah so i'm gonna show y'all the wrapping paper that i got so this is the first one it's gold polka dot so this is one and then this is the other one that i got and that's gonna go perfectly up under my tree and then i got a couple um gift bags for stuff that can't be wrapped but yeah, I did exactly what I said I wasn't going to do. I spent a lot of money and I told myself this year I wasn't going to do that. But I did it. So, yeah. But I'm back at the house. I'm happy to be back home. Like, I love to shop. But when you've been going out all day like that, you just be ready to come back to the house and clean. Like, all I can think about is I'm ready to go back home so I can clean up. <laughs> My phone should be fully activated and working by 12 o'clock that's what they say so hopefully so so tomorrow is we have to dress up and like overdo on christmas accessories so i went to dollar tree and i bought a lot of different christmas stuff like the little headband with the antlers on it i got like the necklace i got bracelets like a couple of stuff and yeah the rest of these are gifts so yeah we finna do some wrapping, girl, until I get tired. I know I'm gonna be up past 12 because I wanna make sure my phone is working. As you can see, I got on my pajama set and it says ho, ho, ho on it. <laughs> it's a pants set, so it's a full pants set and they're comfortable. I got these from TJ Maxx, I believe. Y'all, so I thought my boyfriend went to work and apparently not, so oh, my hair look crazy. So I need to try to hurry up and make his stuff. I mean, wrap his stuff because I was procrastinating. I didn't think that he was gonna be here. 
not a big one but this is the drink i think i showed y'all these already the ones that i had got from the liquor store and you mix these two it's like a mixture it tastes like eggnog kind of so this is what i'm gonna drink not a lot just a little something you yeah, need to try that move penelope so the first gift is wrapped can y'all see what that says to bay from bay <laughs> But yeah, this is the first gift. I'm not even going to record me um, wrapping no gifts because, honey, I don't do a good job at all. That's just the, the, the top part. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to finish the rest. Y'all, so it's 1.15 a.m. <laughs> My phone is activated and it is now working. Um, it just sent me a message to let me know it was activated. Um, I did not finish wrapping all the gifts. I think I only, yeah, I only wrapped two and then there's three that I bagged up. Um, but this is so far how it looks under the tree. Um, those two boxes is, those two boxes is my boyfriend's, that's my niece bag, my mom's bag, and then my boyfriend bag. But I still have other gifts that I need to pack, but that's all I got so far. I'm tired. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll finish. Um, because yeah, I want to show y'all really quick what I got from the Dollar Tree. What I plan to wear tomorrow for work. Whew, tired. Sorry. Um, but I did get these. Yeah, they're so cute. That's how they look. I think they're cute. I bought these glasses. <sighs> Sorry, y'all. Told you I'm tired. And I bought these two bracelets. The green one and the red one. And then I brought the necklace. So it has bells on it. And it's two of them. So I'm going to be making a lot of noise tomorrow. <laughs> but yeah. So we finna go to bed. I guess Penelope be call herself eating some of so I'ma let her eat for a little bit and then we is going to bed. I'm kinda hungry. I'm trying to debate do I wanna go and get me something to eat because I really haven't ate nothing today. But I'll see you guys in the morning, girl. Good morning, you guys. So today is Monday. I wanted to come on here and properly end the vlog because I'm gonna restart this vlog as soon as I'm done with this one. <laughs> so I just wanted to come on here and say thank you guys so much for watching and make sure that you like, you comment, and you subscribe and you join the family cause my girl, my guy, is lit over here, okay? It's lit over here. But I will most definitely, most definitely see y'all in the next video. Bye girl.